Yo, what is going on guys? It's your boy McMean and today I'm coming at you guys with some important Rocket League tips and some gameplay of me using my new controls. I switched my controls recently. As you can see, I binded my boost off of circle and onto L1 so that I can get clean forward flips and just boost right after. It's not like I have to hit X and circle at the same time. Like if I were going for a high aerial, I just want to be able to hit X and not have to worry about hitting two buttons with one finger at the same time. It's just a little bit more difficult than it needs to be. So I just move boost to L1. And then I also moved arrow right to circle and arrow left to square. You know, squares on the left, circles on the right. It just makes it easy. And since my arrow, um, the regular arrow button requires you to use your left stick to adjust your air rolling in the air. Um, it was kind of a nuisance, so I just changed air roll right to circle, and now I can just air roll whichever direction I need without worrying about hitting the left stick while, like, while I'm in the air or something. And it just allows me to get really clean air rolls. I'm able to like, get solid landings when I land after like a high aerial or something. It allows me to keep my speed, keep my momentum, and continue my rotation with high speed. And also. It just really allows me to get power and shots from bad angles, and I'm able to win a lot of 50-50. So right here, I'm gonna show you a kickoff goal that I got because my my controls just feel so clean when I'm going for these kickoffs. It's just so awesome. And then I bury it right in the top corner on a sick air roll, little bit of a flip action. Like, I don't even know what was going on, but it was pretty sweet. And then, as you can see here, I air roll pretty well and get the nose of my car towards the ball after adjusting through the air and I get a powerful shot in the net. Right here, adjust slightly into the air and keep boosting the whole time and I adjust air rolling to the right just a little bit as I'm taking off to hit this ball and I power it right past all of the defense. And right here, I see that there's a defenseman coming into the middle and I air roll and get a powerful shot just barely fast enough to beat him to the net and he, he couldn't really do much about it. But here's a terrible angle shot. I air roll a little bit and bomb it in the net. Here we have an aerial redirect which is also substantially easy with these new controls. And that's gonna conclude the video. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you did, make sure you drop a like, leave a comment and subscribe for more upcoming content. But for now, go and change your settings.